Okay, so today we're working on a 2004 BMW X5. So that is an EWS 3 module, which I have here, which has already been pulled out of the car. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to open this plastic case up and we're going to pull the actual board um, out. Okay, so once you get that off, you got the, you're going to have four little tabs here that you're going to want to squeeze as well. And then that'll just push right out like that. Okay, so make sure when you go into your Key Tool Plus or whatever you're using, you compare to make sure you do have the right EWS module. Um, to get to this menu, you're gonna wanna, from your home screen, you're gonna wanna go to Prog, then MO, and then you'll pick BMW, and then EWS 3, because that's what this one is. And we're gonna be using um, an adapter today. So I've got my adapter here, it's the BMW XDMP50 adapter. So this will show you how to hook it up as well, but uh, I'm just going to go over it with you guys here. So turn this over, you're going to line up your three points with the, the holes in the board. Sorry, like so. You want your pogo pins facing downwards. And then you see this section where it says lock. You're gonna take these green tabs here and you're gonna put them over those, those locks, like so. Okay, so then, um, as you can see in our picture, we have to plug our wire into the first prong. So we're gonna do that. And then we turn this over and then we got this little uh, alligator teeth here. And they're gonna they're gonna hook onto the very first um, part of the board here. So if you go into the other picture on here, this one here, it actually shows you that right here shows you RXD, so that's the one you're gonna stick these little teeth teeth on, is that, is that one. So, so once that's on there, you're gonna plug your wire onto here. All right, so now that's all hooked up and ready to go. So now we will Plug this into our adapter, like so. All right, and then we're gonna hit read. And it's gone. All right, so that reading is complete. So now we'll just Save this. And there we go, that's it for the first part. We'll come back later with the key and we'll actually program the key into the module. Okay, so we saved the EEPROM file, we pulled the data, so now we're gonna actually program the customer's key into the EWS module. All right, so you go to home, and then you go into MO programming, go down to BMW, we're gonna select from system, we know it's an EWS system, and then we're gonna prepare a dealer key from the EEPROM dump. So we prepare a dealer key, start programming, and we know it's an EWS3. We'll load our file in. This one here that we saved. Open that. And here we go. So we gotta fit, pick a free slot. So we'll just pick this one here, number four. We got the key in the programmer. Hit OK. Make dealer key is successful. So now this key can be used to start the car. The remote would have to be programmed separately though.